Well, hello guys, how are you? Now here's a real quick story, kind of showing you the thrill of female nature. And apparently this guy is a football defender, I guess, so they earn a fair bit of money. And he's married to this femon, of course. But it was found out he'd fathered two children outside of the marriage. Of course, this guy earns quite a lot of money, so I guess his femon he was seeing on the side wanted a little piece of the pie, too. Because with all the things on the market, it's very hard to get accidentally pregnant, isn't it? Well, it is if you don't want to get pregnant, that is. Now, we all know femons have strong morals. Well, as long as they got a dollar sign on it, anyway. But this guy's wife is willing to give the marriage another try, if he gives her half his fortune, which works out to be about 15 million pounds. So there it is, guys. If you want your marriage to work with a femon, just give her lots of money. You see, it's not about caring, loving. For femons, it's all about money. Well, we've seen it, really, haven't we? Other marriages, man's doing really well, he's got good money... Everything's great. All of a sudden, he has a bad patch, loses most of his money, becomes kind of destitute. All of a sudden, it isn't long before his wife disappears, or his girlfriend. Because, I guess, feelings and love and caring for femons has a dollar sign on it. And, of course, in every divorce, what's the most important thing at the end of it? Money. And femons try to pretend it's something else, of course. But I believe most males can see through it all today. And there's a good reason why a lot of men kind of call femons W-H-O-R-E-S. But it does prove one thing there, guys. If you really want some feelings, some loyalty, respect, and somebody really for a friend to share your life, then get a dog. I'll put a link to the news item down below. I didn't actually read it, though. But once again, this does prove the fact that the one and the most important thing in Femon's lives is money, not you. Never forget that, guys. Take it easy.